Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in this video, finally I can film this video for you guys. I've been meaning to film this video for like about a week ago or two weeks ago. I don't know. I've I've had this lipstick sitting on my desk. So I haven't done like a sit down video for a while because as you guys know, we are busy with the moving and buying stuff and all that. So yeah i it's this is just my free time to really like film about all of this stuff that i've been meaning to film but anyway so without further ado let's get started so as you can kind of see i don't have anything on my lips it's because we are going to try the new lipsticks from chanel so i got the two lipsticks right here which is the two limited edition i believe from chanel this is their from their fall collection so i got a two of them so the first one that i have is the idyllic which looks like this this is the 836 idyllic so at first i was gonna buy like some items from the fall collection but it's just that i have like a lot of other stuff that are similar to the eyeshadow that they came up with which i do have my cherry palette from urban decay so i didn't go for it i was gonna buy the highlighter and blusher that they have which comes in a stick i'm gonna show you guys what it looks like um, but then it's not limited edition so i can definitely pick it up whenever i want to but i'm most certainly very very excited about the lip colors that they have especially this one um, i think every year chanel launches a new shade of reds whenever it's fall time and i love wearing red lipstick especially during the winter time it's gonna look super good so this is what it looks like this is the ideal lick from chanel infusion i love the frosted glass as you can see although it's not a glass it's a plastic but it's really frosted and classy looking um so i saw some people they use this infusion as like their blusher and their eyeshadow and stuff like that so i think this is very very versatile so that's what i love about this even though this is kind of expensive but it's chanel so it's expected so yeah i got the two shades and then the next one that i got is this one this is the ambigit um ambiguity i don't know how to say that but ambiguity it's just what it says it, yeah it's the a34 and it looks like this it's a nude brown it's the prettiest ever and yeah you have to shake it it's very very liquidy i guess that's why a lot of people uses this everywhere because you can definitely use it as like a blusher because it's very very watery and the liquidy and yeah this is just what it looks like and this is the idyllic so as you can see both of these are like super gorgeous i'm going to try this this is going to be a very very short video so let's try this one the first one is this i'm gonna swatch it for you guys so this is what it looks like this is the kind of like liquid lipsticks that goes on very very liquidy but then once it kind of dries out it's gonna turn like super matte on your lips so that's what i love about it and then let's swatch the red one it's kind of like burgundy red it's not like a true true red as you can see it kind of like has a like a pink undertone so yeah this is just what it looks like super love it first one that i want to try is this one this is the type of lipstick that if you apply it on your lips it's like super liquidy it, it feels like you're not putting anything at all like it doesn't have a lot of pigment but once it dries out you can kind of see that it's like it's glued to your lips is what i am trying to say <laughs> it's so good So yeah this is just what it looks like and i love it because it's not it's the kind of like the 90s brown and it's very perfect for fall because even though it's brown it still kind of look like it's red 
um, if you guys can see it's a very very unique color I'm not sure if you can see that because of the light but later I'm gonna show you what it looks like in front of the natural light but yeah this is the Ambigit Ambigity. really really love this color it's just kind of color that you can honestly like wear every day and i feel like every skin tone would look really good on this um type of lipstick shade so i love that i really really love that and i personally love using like brown tone lipsticks because it can make my lips look bigger especially if you try to overline your lips a bit which i always do so this is what it looks like on my lips and i really really like it this is completely dry as you can see it's really really hard to erase it um although it's kind of like dragging the color but as you can see the pigment is still there if i like really try to remove it it's gonna come off but it's supposed to be like really long lasting and all that so yeah that's that and now let's get into the red lipstick which is the one that i'm like super excited about because i love red lipsticks red lipsticks used to be like my favorite shade of lipstick of all time until until kylie jenner <laughs> since the whole kylie jenner brown lipstick movie type of lips i've been so hooked with using brown lipsticks but originally i really really love red lipsticks so i'm just gonna put the red lipstick now this is like super intense red lipstick and i love it and it has like blue undertone which means it can make your teeth look super white And unlike any other like red lipsticks, this doesn't bleed out. This is what it looks like. I know at first it looks like it's shiny, but once it settled onto your lips, it's gonna look super matte. I know in the camera, I don't know why it looks like it's orange, but it's like a true red. And as you can see, it washes me out. This is the thing about like wearing red lipsticks. It always washes my complexion out, but I love it. I don't know if you could see that, but this is what it looks like, guys. Super duper love it. That's everything in this video, guys. I know buying lipsticks these days are like kind of not necessary. Um, and if I'm like being honest, it's kind of a waste of money if I may say so myself, especially because we are always wearing a mask. And these days, honestly, I'm not even wearing any lipstick at all. What I would do is I would only always use the lip balm from Lip Pop. Um, that's, that's like my go-to everyday lip color. And it's because I'm wearing a mask all the time because here in Canada, you can't really go out without a mask yeah that's everything in this video guys i hope you guys like it it's a very quick video i just really wanted to swatch this for you guys and share with you the two amazing lip colors that chanel recently came out for their fall collection i'm gonna play around more with this um lip color or ink fusions i'm gonna try to use it like on my cheeks and all that so actually let's try to use this so I'm gonna be using this, the brown color, and let's see if it's gonna be... I'm kind of scared. Um, so I'm gonna start off with just like a little bit there. Ooh, it blends out super fast. And that's the nice thing about it is that it's super liquidy. So you have all the time in the world to blend your makeup in or your lipstick in before it settles. I like so i like it i super love it it doesn't look like i put like a brown blusher it just kind of make it look like i just put like a red tone blusher so yeah super like it so yeah that's everything in this video guys i hope you guys like this video even though it's super short 
I just wanted to share with you the new shades that I got from Chanel. These are just the two items that I picked up during their fall collection. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you do, please don't forget to subscribe and like it. And yeah, I'll see you on my next one. Bye.